Welcome everybody to today's video. Today we are doing something a bit different, mainly regarding uh, this thing right here, as you can see. Uh, today we're going to be explaining how to uh, set this mic up right here. This is called the Nacon microphone. It is sort of uh, in partnered with uh, PS4, PlayStation. Not only will I be doing a, a review right now and then a uh, setup tutorial, I've dismantled it. Uh, I will put it together. It's such an easy process, it really is. Now, firstly, before I get into the mantling it all back together again, this cost me £60, £59.99 to be precise. Now, here it is right here. This is the actual microphone. Now, you've got, obviously, a muff comes with it. I don't have the box because I took it out of the box two weeks ago. I've had it for about two weeks now. I've had no problems with it. This is the muff that comes with it. I'm gonna call it a muff. I think this is what they call it. I think that's the Americans call it. Uh, if I get any Americans that are actually watching this video, Put it in the comment below regarding actually what you actually call this damn thing because um, we I think us Brits call it a muff, head muff. I don't know. Anyway, so this uh, goes over it. It's your discretion whether you want it over it or not. I personally do because it blocks out all the background noise. It really, really does help and it sort of uh, uh, gives it a little bit more clarity. Uh, so now this is the stand. Turn it all the way until it obviously hits its point where you cannot go any further. Now, as you can see, I think you can see, it doesn't go all the way. Yeah, hopefully you saw that, that would have been embarrassing if you didn't. It doesn't go all the way, but that's a good sign. If you can't go any further, that means it is uh, completely intact. Uh, now, as you can see, this goes over like this. Just fit completely into whatever this, uh, your discretion completely, or wherever, or however you want it, I'll put it like this. Stand here. And there's your microphone. This is the, uh, the cable that you plug at the back here. And then you plug this into the USB port of your PlayStation. Now, as I said, this is a PlayStation partnership. Uh, Nacon do other microphones, but this is only PlayStation. So it only work on the PlayStation 4 or PlayStation 4 Pro. And then I'm gonna show you the best settings and how to set it up on your PS4 system to get it going completely. Now, it seriously is as easy as this. Now, I currently have my USB uh, port here that you connect with the microphone into the um, PlayStation USB port. And then right here, I have my wireless, don't worry, that's a bit of muffled there. I mean, I've had that for about a year and a bit. It's lasted me that long. Uh, don't mind me there. And I use this for my um, audio output. Now, it seriously is as easy as this. You have the USB right here that you plug into the PlayStation. So as you can see now, the uh, USB is into the PlayStation port. And then right here, you have the other SCART that we put at the back of the uh, Nacon microphone device. So that's in there now. Now you should see a blue light flash. I mean, I've got the muff on currently, but I think underneath the muff, you see the PlayStation light. There you go, there's the blue light. Okay, so that shows that it's on, it's working. Uh, now you've got to just uh, set up the, oh, there you go, that's a fail. Uh, you've got to set up the audio on um, uh, correcting on the actual PlayStation settings itself. And I'm going to show you the best settings for live streaming or anything like that on this PlayStation right now. So now here I am on the PlayStation home screen. Now, don't mind Kabir Cabela in the back. She's the love of my life. Uh, you go on settings. Uh, you go on devices. Uh, now, currently the uh, PlayStation uh, Nacon mic is actually set up to the PlayStation, okay? So that, that's all there ready. Uh, you go on audio devices. And as you can see already, because I've set this up, uh, input device, USB microphone, Nacon streaming microphone. Now, this is the situation. Now, input device is what you're speaking into. That's sort of self-explanatory. An output device is uh, how you're hearing the audio from an, or out of the TV, whether it's through the sound bar, whether it's through the TV itself, whether it's through your headset. I'm gonna connect my PlayStation headset. Uh, the red light should come on now, and you'll see now, here we go. If you connect two at the same time, so currently I've got my PlayStation headset that I wanna use for just the audio out of the, uh, the game. And then I want to use my, obviously, my microphone that is still connected. Let me reach that. So there's my input device. There's my output device. So I've just turned my output device on. 
which I want to be here in the game, not using as a mic. So it's noticed that there's two devices. So I click on obviously the user that you're using and that's what should come up. Now, this will come up, but you don't want it to set throughout. So obviously here it's input device is the USB headset, which is this and output device is USB headset, which is this. I don't want to be using the mic on this uh, device. I want to be using the mic on the Nacon device. So to set that up is so, so easy. You click on input device because it want, is this what the audio input. So you click on that and it should see at the top here, USB microphone, the Nacon streaming microphone. You click that and uh, there you have it, guys. You have your input device, the USB microphone, uh, Nacon streaming device. And then you have the output device, which is what you'll be hearing the in-game audio on this while you have the uh, audio coming out from you. Uh, go straight in into this. So it really is as easy as that. Now, regarding settings wise uh, for the microphone. So when it comes to microphone level, as you can see, uh, I have it, it. It doesn't go any sort of lower than too low in that bracket there. So, for example, that's the middle here. Uh, that's way too loud for me. Uh, and it's it really, really overpowers my voice and you can't even hear the actual in-game audio, which sucks. Uh, you want to be going um, down here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. From middle, you want to be going seven steps back for the best um, uh, input audio results. When it comes to in-game as well, what I do, I tend to go into a party and uh, I create a party for myself, but I go privately, obviously, so then no one can join. I create the party. And this really, this does really balance things out. A lot of people don't know this, but you go on party settings. You, you've obviously got, as I said, the adjust level microphone, which I've done that. And then right here, you've got adjust audio mix. Now you've got non-party audio and then you've got party audio. Now party audio is your voice itself. And then non-party audio is the um, the, the actual in-game audio. So you want to be setting that from the middle. You want to be going one, two, three uh, back from middle. And then that, again, that will give you the best in-game audio results as well. So you want to be, when you're live streaming, you want to be in a, in a private party with yourself. That really tends to give out the best results also. Now, when it comes to live streaming, uh, whether it's on via Twitch or anything, again, it really is it really is easy. You are on sharing it and broadcasts. Here, you've got uh, audio sharing settings. And regarding if you're in a party, you want to be obviously including share party audio. If that's off, you're not even going to be hearing yourself uh, if you're in a party, uh, like the way I've shown you. So you want to make sure this setting is 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 turned on. Uh, and then you're good to go. I mean, that, that that's it. That's the best results uh, regarding the setup uh, for the live streaming, whether it's on Twitch or YouTube. That's the uh, setup tutorial regarding this mic. It really is an easy step-by-step -step process. So uh, I hope this video helped, guys. I'll see you very soon. See you later. Oh,